it's coming. Hi, Mom. Hello. So we're talking about the new ELP. The Enneagram Learning Portal. Yeah, so tell us uh, a little about the ELP. What is it? It's an opportunity for people to explore different aspects of the Enneagram and its business applications in real time whenever they want to. It's very dynamic, it's interactive, it's lots and lots of visuals, incredible content. Um, it's left brain and right brain. It's complete with all kinds of fun quizzes to take. Yeah. It's got videos, yeah. um, and there's three sections. Yeah. One on the Enneagram, one for professionals, coaches, consultants, and trainers, and one for anybody in terms of the applications of the Enneagram to 13 different topic areas. And then we've got subtopics under those 13 topics. What was the uh, most fun part about the ELP, either writing or creating it? I think the first was just conceiving what would be in it because um, we had an ELP, our learning portal, from 2009, but it was very heavy in words. Mm -hmm. And so now we've really navigated our sites to be very both right brain, left brain, visual and words, and to teach a concept that, um, in a way that's easy to, easy to absorb and, and even easier to retain. So. Uh, that's exciting. And then it was fun to work with um, the graphic artist who put all of these things to, um, in the art form, to put the content into visual form and to make it as visual as possible and still have very strong content in it. What are your hopes for the ELP? Well, I designed it so that our, um, I have a network, um, Instagram and Business Network, and so it's really conceived for people like them this is a network, but they get this network because they're all about developing themselves and developing themselves as people and as professionals. So it's for them. It's very kind of a sophisticated network, um, but we're also making it available to anybody else who wants to learn the Enneagram more in depth or um, enhance their professional skills using the Enneagram in the professional section or somebody who wants to see all the variety of applications. Okay. I guess my uh, last question here is, what, what did you learn in the process of creating the ELP? <laughs> it takes a lot longer to do something that's visual and in words than it would ever take in words alone because you have to really condense and get the essence of what you're trying to say and have it work together. And also the variety. Um, we also made sure that there's a variety of mini quizzes and videos and all kinds of different slides and fun things and quotes by famous people that are very inspiring. It's got roomy poems in it. So it's just creating something that's um, creative like that, but also educational and also has a lot of variety to it. Yeah, I mean, I've looked into the ELP and I've uh -huh. worked with it and edited it a little bit. Yeah. And it's definitely state of the art. I feel like it's very much 2019 and it's, a brand new way to learn the Enneagram, which is sophisticated and modern. So, so what about your millennial age group? How do you think they'll like it? I'm interviewing you now. <laughs> That's what twos do. They turn the tables. Um, it's it's interactive, which I think for the millennials is it's fun and mm -hmm. it's in, engaging. So I don't think millennials really like textbooks and it's very much you can learn a lot by doing. Mm -hmm. I'm a three, so I guess I like that part. But mm -hmm. it's, it's very visual and interactive and and modern. You feel like you're working with a very uh, new way of learning. And mm -hmm. it's, it's a fun way of learning. Yeah, and I'd say from my age group, which is I'm over 70, um, and I'm not very high tech, um, but I'm not super low tech. It's really easy to navigate. I made it so I could figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> so that yeah. works. And there's so much in it. There's mm -hmm. tons of information, but it doesn't feel overwhelming, yeah. which is uh, makes it easy to learn. And thanks for all your help on it. Oh, well, okay. Yeah, thanks. Okay.